Hello, hello, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you so much for tuning in if you're new and welcome back if you're returning. I truly appreciate your support. What is this mess you ask? Well, I decided that today would be a good day to go ahead and go through my very unused, for the most part, <laughs> washi collection. And it's time to do some de-stashing. So I'm going to give you a second. Go grab your washi. Yep. Yep, get it. Go on, go get it. It's just like stickers. Just like stickers. We're going to organize today, y'all. It's 2023. Let's get organized. Go grab your washi and let's let's start de-stashing. We can do it, friends. I know it's hard, but we can do it. Look, I already have this pile right here that's going to be gone. I already have it. And I was like, you know what? Why do this alone? You know, friends help friends de-stash. <laughs> so get your washi. Let's go. You ready? Okay, great. So I have two storage containers of washi. So I have this smaller one and it has like the three drawers. I don't honestly remember where any of these things came from. So sorry. But it does have the three drawers which how did i lose the third drawer one two friends see already starting off wrong i don't know where i put the third drawer <laughs> this one is organized came from my drawers seriously this is crazy oh whoa all right so sorry I have the, it's the three drawer thing. And I took these little Simply Gala stickers and put them on there because I thought that would make them extra cute. So anyway, I am super proud to say that I have now condensed my three drawers for this container down to just two. So bonus. So I'm going to stick those back in there. I have been collecting washi for like years and years and years and years and years and years. And I used to literally be the person that every time they saw some from like anywhere, I would just go buy it. But I don't want to be that person anymore because to be perfectly honest with you, like I very rarely even use the washi. So some of these I am going to, I need somewhere to put these. Some of these I'm going to just like take to work because my kids will love it. Like my kids will just absolutely love playing with flamingo washi. Like they'll just have tape stuck on everything. So some of these I'm gonna take to work and then others I'm literally going to just put in a bag or something. And then when I see people that say, oh, I'm new to planning, I'm like, oh, you want some washi? Cause I'll send it to you. I love doing that. So if you, in fact, or a person that is either obsessed with washi or you just want more or you don't have any washi and you'd like to start a collection, leave me a comment below because I would be more than happy to send it to you. So a few days ago, I had actually started doing this process and these are the ones that I had already pulled out. But I'm like, why did I take out my donut washi? Oh, wait. Ixnay el donut washi. We're going to put that back in the stash. I was looking for that. So yeah, so these are some of the ones that I had already pulled out that I'm like, Brandy, for real, you're probably never going to use these. Take these out. So I think what this is what I'll do. So if you comment below and say, hey, I want some washi. My grandma randomly gave me these bags. And I was like, dude, why would you give me these bags? But now I'm like, hey, thanks, Granny. <laughs> it's like she secretly knew I might need bags. So yeah, so I'm going to probably just put little bags together like this and literally like shoot me a comment either well send me a comment on here to let me know that you're going to message me on instagram and like literally i'll just i'll just send you a random bag of washing because i have it if you are watching this video though and you are in fact a washi dare i say hoarder like myself don't don't ask me for more washi friends <laughs> because the whole purpose of this video is to get rid of get get rid of the washi not add to the washi collection <laughs> so if you are a washi hoarder no don't do it do not i mean you can but but you shouldn't because 
We're trying to we're trying to declutter in 2023. So yeah, I'm gonna stick my donut washi here with my sprinkle washi because it's almost my birthday and I'm gonna need donuts and sprinkles for my birthday. I'm actually literally doing a donut party because I'm turning 40. Whoa. Prayerfully, I will be turning 40. And I am going to do a donut party. So I wanted to do like the big 4-0 with the donut circle because I thought that'd be really cute. And I've been like thinking about this for like five years or so. So I'm super excited about that. Anyway, back to the washi. So now I have this drawer and this drawer has like more miscellaneous shop washi. So I was trying to like... Um, almost like categorize them in a way. So I really want to keep the super like thin ones together because they do honestly get a little difficult to find when they're like all mixed up. So the goal for this honestly would be to literally only use these three big shelves like that's the goal. So I do have this little once more with low washi and I do have some the Coffee Monsters co-washi. Oh my gosh, isn't this so cute? She sent out this free like printable that holds washi. So I'm going to just keep this in here because it's cute. But I do plan on hopefully getting some more Coffee Monsters co-washi at some point. So yeah. I do like these. And these came from Elisa Revell when she had her 12 Days of Surprises. And I know that because I took her label ha, 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 and stuck it inside. And they're all super cute. So I'm going to keep those because you just never know when you might need some thin washi. This is from Mandy Lynn Plans. Also going to keep that one. This one is also from Elisa Revell. I don't know about this one, y'all. Like, I don't know. I don't know. We're going to put this in the probably giveaway pile. This one I love, so I'm keeping this one for sure. This one is from Mandy Lynn Plans. Keeping that one for sure. The Hello Kitty. I love the coral one and the green one. I don't necessarily need the cactus one. Also for Mandy Lynn Plans, but I'm going to stick that in the skinny washi section. These ones I'm also going to put in the skinny washi. And those literally, you just never know when you might need some basic ones. I have so many of these like girls because back in the day, I just had to have all of them. But now that I'm looking at them, I'm like, Brandy, really? Okay, so I know for sure I don't need these. I just love the look of this one. So I'm going to keep this one. And then I put those with the thins. And eh, I don't need it. All right. And then these girls here, I have no idea where they came from. I really like this one, but I don't. This is where I get in trouble. I'm going to keep it. And then these are foreign, so I have to keep these. Amanda uh, bought these for me when she went to Germany. So I'm keeping those just because of like sheer nostalgia. <laughs> she also bought me this one, but this one I don't need because I like know for sure I will never use it. Um, I love my nature -y ones. I'm gonna put this over here for now. I do I will often throw in a tree or a flower or a plant just randomly. Starbucks not going anywhere. <laughs> Duh. I don't need the legs. Here's some clouds. Um I do like Mm, I don't need it. I love this one. Uh, this one is, I love the pattern. But I think this is the washi that I don't. Yeah, I don't care for this type of washi because it's like that 
weird papery stuff. And I don't like it. This one, there is no, what is this, good books? I don't know, that's, I don't know what this is. I wonder if this will fit on one of my, Mm, no, that'll be too hard. Um, I don't know. I do like the colors in this. We're going to keep it just in case. And then this polka dots. You can never have too many polka dots. I do have some ocean ones because one day I'm going to get back there. I dwindled down my butterflies to just three. I think even though I used to have like a million of them all right so oh now these are literally all from my simply gilded collection so these I am for sure going to keep because I legit took the time to match them up and partner them together so I am going to keep all of the ones here because simply because I took the time to do that now and then I like this color so like this one I don't need it this one don't need it this one I really like the fawn do I need it though mm, no this one I love so we're gonna keep that one and then I have <laughs> this drawer so let's move this one out of the way. If I can get to just one container of Simply Gilded, that would be amazing. All right, so the plants, and it doesn't even necessarily have to stay like Simply Gilded exclusive, I guess. <gasps> I can get them out of here. All right, do I need jellyfish? No. Music notes? See, probably not. Sakura? See, probably not. Love this one. Uh, nah. Some of these are like kit specific. Oh, I like this one. It's kind of it's very summery. Uh, keeping the butterflies. There's no real way. I do like this pattern. It feels very cozy. I don't know what that is, but it kind of makes me feel some kind of way. This is very, eh, I don't need that. Gotta keep it. Paris? I've never been to Paris, but what if I go? <laughs> I'm keeping it. <laughs> um, hummingbirds, I don't need. I love the books though. I love the feathers. This color, don't need, don't love it. This color, love it. Don't need those. Look at me. Y'all better, y'all better be uh de-stashing. This is what we're doing today. De-stashing. If you're not, it's not too late. Let's go. Um I don't love it. I don't love it. Bikes keeping. I love bikes. All right, and then that one's pretty. I don't need those. I don't love that one. I really like this one. I like this purpley one. I like this floral. That one's pretty. Need a neutral. Love the watermelons. So cute. I like the floral. Don't need that one. That one's cute. Don't need that one. Definitely keeping the coffee. Some of these I didn't even know were Simply Gilded. Oh, I love the airplane one. And the these are cute for some thins. I forgot that I was going to try to keep all the like thinner ones together. So whether they're from Simply Gilded or not, it's no longer relevant. So we'll put 
all of the thinner washi in this one. Sorry, you can't even see what I'm doing. Like this one here, there's not even enough on there. So I'm going to put that one to the side. And then those little washi things, these are what I put like samples on. So when I get done, I'm going to just wrap those around on these and get rid of the rolls. I need to get some more of these. Those washi sample things too, when I when my shop was open, I used to send those out in orders. <laughs> so that's why I have those. All right. Yes. Okay. So I'm keeping all of these. Now I got to figure out how to wiggle these out of here. <sighs> hmm. Scissors? I mean, that's totally not scissors. That is a ruler. <laughs> English. All right. So don't need that one. Don't need that one. Don't need that one. I do like those stripes. That's gorgeous. Love that one. Oh, do these two go together? Yes. So let me put these over here. I, I really did try to go through and like match them with the like set if I could for no other reason other than the fact that I think it looks cool to be matched like that. <laughs> All right, so I don't really care about the buildings or this like doily kind of thing. I'm not really feeling that. I do love the globe. Gotta keep the cupcake or the sprinkles. Um, I like these diamonds more than those. Love the plants. I am going to keep those. Then these are all the other ones I was going to keep. Put that over there. These are the like collection ones. Uh, I don't really, I don't think I love this. And I got the feeling that's going to be one of those textured ones that I don't like. So we're going to move that one out. All right. And then we're going to put these here. We'll put these here. And... Oh, wait, I don't have to do that. Okay, so I'm going to leave this drawer alone because it does have my, like, pairs. So this drawer, I'm going to just leave as it is. This drawer, do I have any more? I'll put that one in there because it's kind of small. All right, so that drawer is done. Which leaves me now left with just this one. So we will put these in here. And I honestly will probably be doing this again very soon. Just as the year progresses, like if I'm not, if I'm not using it, it's going away. Like I can't, I don't want to keep, I don't want to keep hoarding it if I'm not actually going to use it. I found some more thin ones over here. So I'm going to put those in there. Ooh, got this candle over here. Hotness. All right, I've been like trying to light candles too because I've hoarded those. <laughs> so I've been lighting candles. <laughs> All right. Ah. 
All right, I did it. All right, so with the exception of this, which is not going anywhere, my sticker box is empty, so I can get rid of this one. Oh, that makes me so happy. Yay! Well, I probably won't get rid of it. I'll just repurpose it for something else. Because maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I'll get rid of it. Maybe I'll repurpose it. We'll see. I, I wish it didn't have these little... I wonder if I can break those off without ruining it. I wish it didn't have these dividers in there because then it would be more functional but i might be able to store like because i do have like an abundance of paper clips and push pins and things like that so maybe i can store those in there does white outfit because i have yes i do have like a ridiculous amount of these and glue oh yes okay so i'll probably just repurpose this i don't think yeah no those will fit there too long so I don't think any pins or mild liners or anything like that will fit in here. But I also have like post-it notes. Yep. So yeah, I'll just repurpose this for all of the other little miscellaneous things that I just have laying around. But I'm so excited. You guys, I'm so excited. I'm just down to one container. So yeah, I will be again pulling out some of these that I think my kids would love at school. I'm going to be taking these four tapes here and putting them on these to get rid of these rolls. And then, yeah, leave me a comment. Like I said, leave me a comment below if you'd like a little bag of washi. And shoot me your address on Instagram and I will get that sent to you as soon as I can. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you took this opportunity to go ahead and de-stash with me. If you didn't, it's not too late. Watch it again. When you're ready to de-stash, share it with all your friends that you need, that you know need to de-stash some washi. Go ahead and send this as a little subliminal message to them. <laughs> and I'll see you guys on the next video. Be safe, be well. Talk to you soon.